Hi my magical friends, it's Jess from My Magical Planner and today I have a little bit of an unboxing for you guys. This has actually been sitting in my office for well over a month. I It's one of my planners for this next year and I just haven't taken the time to open it up with you guys so let's get into that today. So let's see. It always comes from JetPens. They generally put it in some kind of you know US Postal Mail Service. It comes here pretty fast overall. Just trying to decide, like, how should I open this? Is there a tab? I don't think there's a tab. I don't think it was this beat up when it got here, to be honest. I think this has been a product of my children. So, lessons to sell. Open things faster. <laughs> but it is very well padded and everything inside here. Okay. And this must be my receipt. Which, let me show you guys this. Pull this over. So on their receipts they print little comics and I think it's adorable. So I absolutely love that. I also love their videos. They do a bunch of videos on YouTube and they're just hilarious. So okay I did put some other miscellaneous things in this order so honestly I can't remember what I ordered. Here's that. I cut here. Okay. So let's put these things off to the side. And here my planner. So I did order another one of the Hobonashi Cousins because I have really enjoyed it this year. I have the Avac so it comes in two volumes which is really nice because you essentially get to start over halfway through the year. And let's open these up. I'm sure you guys have seen lots of these unboxings already. So here are my volumes and I'm excited about this. This is going to be my content planner for this next year. So it comes with this little cute thing that I always wish I could read, but I can't. So I, I did debate. They have an English version and I really debated getting that one, but I wanted it in the two volumes. Oh, that's cute. I could have ordered the, this directly from Hobonashi, which oh, I think I'm saying that right this time, but I'm not sure. Anyhow, anyhow, but I I got a little confused on some of the details on the site. <laughs> and so I just decided to order from JetPens because it was easier. It's in the U.S. and I did have to wait a little longer to get it opposed to if I'd ordered it straight from them, I think, and I didn't get the like little spoon or the, they had a special pen. So I'm going to do a quick uh, flip through of the first tab here, kind of in case you guys haven't seen it before. So it's a really nice paper in here. So these are more like thicker papers. And then you start here. And a lot of people call this like Bible paper. It's, um, something river paper and so it's really thin but you don't get a ton of bleed through because it's like this really special paper so you have your year to glance up here and then you have like each month and you have a line for each month plus you have a spot to put like your top three up there and then you have room here at the bottom to list other things so and they do January through December in this first one. And then you start in December here. Oh, I could transfer over at the end of this month. Maybe I'll do that. And then, so you have each one of the months here, which is really nice. This is where I'm planning on getting my, like kind of overview what videos am I hoping to put down. I actually am working on a video where I take you through my whole process and with <clears throat> with uh, weekly checkups, so that should be coming out soon. And then after that, 
you have weekly views, which are really, really nice. So I generally, what I'll do is I'll take the information from that monthly view and I'll plan out the week and show myself what I need to do and give myself a checklist. This will probably also be where any Instagram um, photo ideas are gonna go. And then at the back, I have daily pages. The, okay, there. Turning a page to a new year, which is really fun. So you could do your like vision board here, which I think I'm gonna do is my vision board for my channel here. And then I have daily views, which I can put any YouTube ideas I come up with, notes about things I'm learning about YouTube, you know, different strategies, different ways to edit videos, that kind of thing. I have a place to take notes about them. And then I can be able to reference back to them. So that's my general thought right now. I'm still fine tuning the process. And I do have some stickers on the way to set these up. Hopefully they'll be here soon. So, and the, let's see, the June through December. One thing I wanted to look is how much of the monthly do we have in here? So, oh yeah, so this one starts in July and does through December. It doesn't have the full year. Oh, well, it has the next, <laughs> they're just in a different order. So you have July through December and then you have January through June. So I'm going to think about how I want to modify this page because I'm thinking it might be nice to have like an index as well as I'd like to put any PR stuff or anything like that in this area. So anyhow, so there's that. I also got one of these Tombow like whiteout pens because everybody raves about these things. So let me see, do I have something I can white out? Not really. <laughs> um, we'll just do it on the back of here, I guess. So essentially you like push this little button and it comes out and then you can just, oh, that's so easy. Much better than the ones I've been using. And then I think the end here is an eraser, which is really nice. And you can get refills for these. And I tell you how much it was, but I can't remember. Hold on, does it stay on my sheet? It does not. So I got one of those. And then I also got this, which I was very fascinated with because I'm always looking at new ways to house my stickers. So and I think this was a new item that they brought in. So it is a sticker book where you can slide stuff in at the top. Oh, I thought that we were divided. I thought I got the one that was divided like this, but maybe I didn't. But anyhow, it's a really slim, so this would work really well actually for the, if you have any of the weekly kits for the Hobodashi Weekly, which are thinner, this would actually fit perfectly for those. I don't know if it's gonna work for what I wanted it for. Um. Actually, let me grab out a weekly kit. I don't have one, but I have ordered one. So let me find that real quick. Oh, actually, it might work for some of these stickers. So I have like stickers like this. It looks like it's gonna be the perfect size for these guys. Oh yeah, see? So, and then it does come with this, which I don't know what this is. Let's look. I still don't know what this is. <laughs> is it paper? Like, could I label? I don't know. Because it's like really smooth on this side and kind of like a matte paper on that side. Oh, these might be like double, like sticky stuff or something. Anyhow, it comes with those, whatever those are. And this little pocket in the front that you can put stuff in. Maybe. There you go. And voila. Okay, on to the next thing. So I also ordered these two little washi tapes. 
So let's open these up. I thought they were really cute. And I, I don't know if I'm going to use them in this planner or if they'll be in my main planner or some combination thereof. They are a lot, like there's ever, <laughs> there's a lot less on these rolls than you would get in like a Simply Gilded roll. And it's a lot thinner too. Um, let's see, is it the same as my five mil? Actually, I think it's probably just a little thinner, so probably a four. And a little harder to open because I don't know how to open it. <laughs> but let's see here. Okay, you feel like you're going that way. Alrighty. Gotcha. Aha. Alright, let's open this one too at the same time. I don't know if these are still in the shop. I'm assuming they might be, but I'm not positive. I do like that one's packaging a little better. So, let me grab out my current planner. And let's just go to someplace in the back. Look here, and let's test these guys out. So, there's my end. I can't remember if these are perforated or not. I don't think so. Okay. Oh, maybe they are. Hold on. They are. Okay. It's a lot thinner also than the Simply Gilded Washi, but you could... Let's put it right here. Put it right there. I didn't line that up super great, but the idea is that you can then circle your weather for the day, whether or not it's sunny, cloudy, rainy, precipitating, whatever. And it just has different colors. So you have this blue, there's like more of a gray, there's a teal, a pink, a yellow, or more orange, I guess. And then I think you kind of start over. So I thought that was really cute. And then I got this one because I thought it was adorable. So, let me see if I can find the end on this one. This is just a raindrop one, but it's so, so cute. Okay, I think it starts there. Okay, my knife works better. This is like the part that's hardest for me, is getting that first little bit up. There we go. Oh, there we go with the, yeah. Almost got it, I swear. That's sticky. Okay, hold on, there we go. Now look at how cute this is. Oh, is this, maybe it's supposed to go the other way because like, rain, oh. okay, raindrops kind of have the big part on the bottom, right? Oh my gosh, guys, look at how adorable that is. And I don't know how well you can see it, but it's got like this sparkle foil to it, and it's just amazingly cute. All right, that's all I have from Jet Pens, and I'm really excited about getting into this new Hobonashi and getting everything set up and everything. It's going to be so much fun, and I will record that, so that'll be coming up in the next couple of weeks here. And... I'm going to go ahead and link jet pens down below. I will either put links to these items or give you the names of them so that you can find them as well. So anyhow, that's it. And I hope you guys are having a great day. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button over there. Until next time, I'll see you guys real soon.